Well, it's aptly named, and I can speak on this because this has happened twice. Death Valley is an extremely transformative place, spiritually, on every, I'd say on every level. When you go down there, <laughs> you are going to um, go through a soul movement of some sorts. And the first time it happened to me, it was actually rather traumatic. I was thankfully with a friend and we were just overnighting in the park on our way up north. And it was really scary. I'll just say that. I remember a lot that I was having to like come to terms with in terms of like past life regression and just uh, soul fragmentation and yeah. So fast forward to last week, I was moving through the area uh, trying to avoid it, not wanting to go through the park at all, but I found myself in the region and I was going through similar effects. It was very uh, shamanic, very uh, surreal experience. But anyway, I'll get to what I wanted to talk about in the video because I guess most of us know that these places are really intense. But what some of us don't know is that Highway 95 in Nevada is haunted. I want to talk to you about the experience I had, give you a little ghost story, and it's cool. It's not scary. I actually had like a friendly ghost experience. This trip was really fun. I had just a really good time like exploring brand new area. Uh, one of the overnight stays, really safe, really clean, fun for the dogs. It was like a pond and two... I think they're like geese or something, but they were so cool with T-Rex and it was just, it was so fun. But down the way a little bit, there was this casino that had been there for a while and the area was really desolate, like really out in the middle of nowhere. And the casino was named after this guy, Longstreet. And I was, you know, looking up on my phone, like trying to get service, like, what is this casino about? You know, why, why did they name it after this guy? And I couldn't really get service, but I knew that they had Wi-Fi over in the casino. So I just wandered over there with Opie actually. And all of a sudden I just like tune into a whole nother like vortex world. I could see so many spirits <laughs> and like, I could see just, it was really cool. There's another place that this reminded me of, Jerome, Arizona, which is totally known for being haunted. But it was the same vibe. It was almost like there was a party going on on another dimension and you could just like almost pick it up. But the ghosts were happy. I know this for a fact because I'm super sensitive and I know when things are, you know negative these ghosts were like benevolent and <laughs> they were like trying to support my journey and I just felt like I don't know I just felt like I was comforted and welcome there and I ended up reading up on Longstreet and this guy is like a badass you know just he he did a lot for his community and I felt his spirit so crazy there the, the night that I stayed, because I stayed, like, away from the casino, but it was really intense signs to, like, protect myself, and I was uh, also getting signs about the, uh, the battery, which happened the next day. So Longstreet, I feel, was, like, trying to protect me, and I just felt these spirits commune, and I know that some of you might be thinking, wow, but I also know that, no, you guys are here. You guys are totally adept to the spirit world, and you know how this works, and not all of us have bodies, and some of, some spirits just, like, work in other realms, <clears throat> but anyway, I just thought that was so cool. 
driving up this highway 95 just so remote but feeling the connection to the land that historical part of it is so interesting and that's what I've started to get into more sometimes I've been reluctant to like go into places and like because I didn't want to pick up the energy but sometimes it can be good you can learn a lot and you can get like spirit friends that will help you but anyway I wanted to share that with you because some people don't like talking about ghosts but it's like my life <laughs> I'm just you know I'm Casper myself up on here and we're chilling just enjoying the subtle energies 